Yo guys, welcome back to another Seth Geek YouTube video on the channel today and we have so much exciting Marvel news and DC news coming to your face today. So obviously like, subscribe, hit that post notification bell to keep up to with all the videos coming so they're going to be thick and fast and today's video is going to be all about this newly announced set here that we had leaked information for and I've already done a previous video about. It's the 76261 Spider-Man Final Battle coming in at the $104.99 mark which is a little bit strange. I would have kept it to $100 there. There is 900 parts in this one coming out on august 1st 2023 and coming in with nine minifigures we have spider-man the friendly neighborhood spider-man the amazing spider-man doctor strange mj ned green goblin electro and doc Ock, which is awesome for you guys the box art is looking very clean and I love the, the three Spider-Man running down the top right-hand corner there. It's the same box that we've received um, for a lot of these uh, Marvel sets that we've received for a couple of years now. With the uh, comic book stuff there, we previously have had leaks and little teasers to set. So I should take a deep dive on that comic book stuff later. But I'm not going to because there's so much content here. It's the final battle here. So we only get the head of the Statue of Liberty, which is fine for me. It's in the brown, which it looks strange, but the scaffolding works so well here. And our minifigures are battling here. It's a little bit smaller that I would like because if we have all our characters, all nine of them, it looks quite crowded. Great here, we have Electro at the top and we have uh, the Green Goblin here throwing his pumpkin bombs with the Tom Holland Spider-Man fighting off against him. This is the back of the box here. We can see a couple of the play features the top of it can come off and obviously sandman can go inside there and then we can see the back there we see a closer look at that in just a second but i think the back of the box is uh, box art and the background here is a lot better than the front because the front looks a bit strange especially in this bottom uh, left hand corner it just looks a bit like it's in the middle of nowhere sort of thing but that's okay that's just some box art that's not too bad we were looking at the set here and we have Embry swinging around here like she's basically Spider-Man. There's so much of these uh, translucent um, pieces here so they can float. So we have the Electro at the top, which is an amazing minifigure. So good for Electro. Then we have Green Goblin as well, obviously. And we have Ned floating. We can get a closer look at Ned in just a second. But this is a great image here with just the white background. And oh, it's so, so good. We have a little camera up here. Obviously, Peter Parker with the cameras, which is cool as well. It just looks a bit crowded for me. If, even if it was slightly bigger, be, this is the box down here. And we have uh, Doctor Strange here as well. Interesting, this is one of the play features that can open up. This is going to, unfortunately, be a sticker here. It'd be awesome if it was a print, but it's the Sanctum Santorum, which I do have in Lego. And it's the exact Lego version of the Sanctum, which is amazing to see as well. We have, obviously, the rings that we've received before in this poly bag. Um, the printed rings which is awesome as well we have the machine here and we can see the top opening up for sandman obviously going inside there and we can see a closer look at uh, the machine here and also ned flying i think we've received ned, ned before i don't know if there'll be a double-sided face there might well be these are some lifestyle images but that is all the information for this guy i would do a, a little bit more detailed uh, image look and also look at the minifigures but there's so much content coming to your face of what's just been newly released so i'm gonna have to keep up today and keep on going with the rest of the videos but hopefully you've enjoyed here guys like subscribe hit that post notification bell to get up to date with all the content coming to your face and also leave in the comments down below how you feel about this do you think the scaling of this is slightly slightly too small do you think the price is accurate or do you think it's a bit too pricey do you like the minifigures involved would you want to receive some more obviously we're missing like sandman here unfortunately but who do you want to see in this if we have missed anyone and just leave your comments down below and hopefully i get to them anyways peace out and i'll see you guys later on the next one bye guys